If you hate the frustration of having to scroll through long social media feeds, blog posts, and even web pages, then enter the world of Flex Scroll, an app that will eliminate that frustration within seconds. Just select your desired apps that you want to auto scroll, and now, whenever you launch any of your selected apps, you'll be presented by a floating widget that has several buttons that you can use to scroll up, down, skip back and forth to a certain point of the screen and even adjust the scrolling speed to your likings. And I personally tested the app and it worked just fine with every app I tried it on including Instagram whereas I could set a timer for 6 seconds and the app would auto scroll to the next Instagram reel as soon as the time was done. Plus, if you dive into the app settings, you can customize a bunch of things so that you can get the app to function as you want just in case if you don't like the default settings. Second on the list is GCPU, an app that is the ultimate solution for accessing detailed insights into your phone's CPU, RAM, battery, cameras, and more. And the major standout point here is how the information is beautifully presented by the app. For instance, is the CPU section, whereby with just a tap, you can access a wealth of information of your CPU, including chipset name, design, number of cores, and more which are carefully presented in a sense that the information doesn't look like homework. Also, the design extends to other information like battery, storage, network and display, making the app beautiful and functional in every angle. Like, who wouldn't love the design of the app? Plus, the app has a testing feature that lets you test various hardware components of your phone which is super useful because it can easily help you determine any hardware defect present on your phone. If you're one of the few people in the population that don't take selfies or ever use their front camera, you can simply turn your front camera into a fully functional button to take screenshots, toggle flashlight, pause music, and even access your favorite apps with just a simple setup using the app Touch the Notch. Just grant it all necessary permissions, then select any of the touch options, and then configure how should the app respond to a specific touch, and you're good to go. And hey, subscribe to the channel to get updated with the best Android videos that will level up your smartphone usage. Next on the list is an app that gives you detailed insights of your device's battery by giving you information about the estimated battery capacity, the current battery temperature, the charging and discharging rates, and most importantly, it shows you your battery's health and how much of its capacity it has lost over time, which is automatically calculated based on your charging sessions. Plus, if you want some extra information concerning your battery, just tap on the three dots on the top right corner of the screen, then select other, then set settings, then permission manager, and then select the info you want to be displayed by the app. But do keep in mind that some of this information can only be displayed by granting permission to the app through ADB or Shizuku. Next on the list is an app that lets you automate your device in a sense that it will perform any SSD request with just a tap of a button, helping you remove the frustration of having to follow the same steps over and over again to perform a common request. And to make the automation possible, just tap on the plus icon at the bottom here, then select record, then give your request a name, then again tap on the plus icon at the bottom here and type in your SSD number, then hit on save, then hit record and perform the SSD request and when you're done, stop the recording and click on save. And now, whenever you want to perform a certain SSD request, just tap on the play button next to any of the requests and the app will do everything for you. Plus, you can also automate things like USSD prompts, terminate a request sequence, save USSD dialog messages, and so much more with the app. If you prefer listening to songs on your internal storage rather than on Spotify or YouTube Music, then Fast Lyrics is the app you need because you can simply play any song on your internal storage and the app will automatically fetch lyrics for that specific song. Also, the app is smart enough to understand that when you pause a song, it should also stop syncing the lyrics, which is really nice. Plus, you can view downloaded lyrics in the saved section of the app and even use them without an internet connection.